on Eric. God, look at you. You look beautiful. Look like you got hit by a Mack truck. God, I miss you. I love you so much. Who ordered all this stuff? I don't know. But help yourself, though. I recommend the chocolate croissants. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thanks. That a girl? Like you need it. So, I see you found the secret room, huh? Yes. Uh, I, I know Tess Wilder, and she let me watch a focus group once. <laughs> They're a hoot, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. So how's it going? Good, good. How you doing? No, no, no. With Steffi, how's it going? Well, you know, I'm trying not to go overboard on this white knight routine, but uh, I mean, I don't, I don't want her to get suspicious. Yeah. I, she seems to be taking the bait. Oh no, she looks kind of down to me. Look, I'm throwing every perk I can at her. I've got her upgraded to the executive suite in the towers. I've given her a limousine. I'm doing all that I can. Well, maybe it's not enough. Is she eating? How should I know? Well, I'm paying you to know. Look, I don't need this, all right? I make a decent living, and I just don't need Okay, this. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Please, Mr. Brooks. She's sick. And she needs someone. She needs you. Come on, Eric, hurry up. Needs me? What do you want me to do? You want me to date her? God, no, 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 I just, I want you to take care of her. All right, well, if she's so needy and you're so crazy about her, then why don't you take care of her yourself? I can't. Why not? Well, I, I can't really go into it right Look, now. you said she was sick. <clears throat> what do you mean exactly? She's bulimic. Oh, no. Oh, no, these poor models. I know. These beautiful, beautiful women, and they got everything to look forward to in life. Well, that's why I, I, I had the food, you know, the pastries and the fruit and everything. And if she asked where it came from, you just... Compliments and PCG. Exactly. Yeah. Well, has she eaten anything yet? No, not yet. You know, the best way to deal with this food thing is to try and get her to forget about the food. What do you mean? Well, you make her laugh, make her feel good about herself. Um, for instance, we had a food fight once. Yeah? Yeah, it was pretty funny. And she told me afterwards that that breakfast was one of the few meals that she, she didn't think about food as an enemy. Her enemy? Yeah, that's what she said, exact words. Well, sounds like you guys used to have some really good times together. We did. <laughs> we did. We spent a night in jail together once, actually. <laughs> You're kidding. For no. what? Well, it was uh, a long story, but it involved forgery and public lewdness. No, oh, I don't know. I don't need to hear this. She was doing this imitation of her mother, and she needed a diversion, so I uh, ran naked through a bank. I'm not even going to ask on that one. <laughs> She's quite a woman. Yeah. yeah she is. So sorry, I got uh, tied up on the phone. Oh, no problem. So, you taking a look at the clothes? Anything you like? I like all of them. Good. Because you've got to try them all on, because we need to find something for the shoot. Okay, what should I start with? Uh, well, how about breakfast? No. Compliments thanks. of BCG. It's all right, I'm not hungry. Come on. Well, we've got some time to kill. The stylist isn't here yet. No, thank you. Did you already eat? No, I'm just not hungry. Go ahead. Well, I don't know. So you don't want a, a banana? Yes, I'm sure. An apple? Hey, an what arm, are you doing? Pear? Great! <laughs> I'm just checking your reflexes. Because the models need to have good reflexes. They do? Yeah, they're going to play on our company softball team, they do. I'm ashamed. That's my girl. <laughs> You know, that's the third time. What? Yeah, I'm sorry? That is the third time that you've looked in that mirror since we've been in this room. Uh, I didn't 
know. I'm worse than Warren Beatty. What, what did I say? Is there somebody back there? It's a two-way. That's a two-way mirror? Mm-hmm. You didn't know that? No. I thought somebody from Romeo Fines was back there checking me out. Oh, no, no, no. Hmm. Well, it would explain why you've been so good to me. Do you think I need an excuse? Eric, this is a huge contract. I mean, any model would be so grateful to have it. You don't have to be so nice to me. It's just the kind of guy I am, I guess. Thank you.